Well, greetings. Uh, on this bright and beautiful day, some news from the TND at the TND.com, as well as our Tuesday print edition. You're going to read today about how the city of Orangeburg is trying to get Norfolk Southern to do some cleanup on its area that across from the universities. And uh, this is not the first encounter with the city in Norfolk Southern. We'll have to see how this comes out. The speed of trains has previously been an issue and one that has never been really completely resolved there either. Also got some news today about some other things you're going to find of interest in the business world. Uh, Gibbs Ford uh, on St. Matthews Road slash 601 is now going to become McDaniels Ford. Uh, owned by the McDaniels Group from Columbia. The change will include expansion of the Gibbs Ford uh, Enterprise to include the sale of Ford commercial trucks. Also today, you can read about the renovation of the McDonald's uh, out near the interstate uh, I-26 at 601. You will also find out that uh, Solicitor Dave, David Pasco who has been a real advocate for reform in the way we pick judges in South Carolina, is going to hold a session at OC Tech on this subject on Thursday at 6 p.m. Read all about that and decide whether you wish to attend and become part of that same effort. Editorial today focuses on Old Glory, the U.S. flag. Tomorrow is Flag Day, and uh, we offer some insight there on the history of Old Glory and a, a whole lot more. Of course, we continue to bring you the latest in sports. Uh, we'll be looking to update the baseball regionals today. And again, we will keep you posted uh, on breaking stories at the TND.com as we work also on another expanded uh, print product, which will be out Thursday morning. Remember that every day there is an e-edition at the TND.com if you wish to get news from newspaper type pages. All right. Have a good day.